Derek Jeter just had his first press conference as part owner of the uh, Miami Marlins, Aaron. Oh, I did not see that. He's come in guns blazing, uh, firing some dudes. I know that. What'd you think of that, Aaron? You know, from afar, it was, you know, a little interesting that he's, you know, I mean, at the end of the day, it's, it's, on, it's on him, and, and you've got to make the decisions that you think are best for the organization. But it did seem a little bit quick from afar of, of, of firing some guys that maybe you haven't got to know yet. Do so you think he's got some Steinbrenner in him, Aaron? <laughs> Seriously. He, I mean, ab, uh, absolutely. I, I think there are a lot of qualities about uh, the boss that, that Derek Cheater respected, and, and I'm sure uh, may be something that he takes with him a little bit. Now, I'm, I'm thinking this, Aaron, because we had one of our, uh, our listeners tweeted, uh, tweeted at the show in the last uh, hour when we talked about Jeter, wondering if he would ever come back for an old-timer's day in Yankee Stadium, and my thought is Jeter is the type to say that that part of his life is closed, that he would not – I'm not saying he would never show back up again, but as long as he's the owner of the Miami Marlins, that's his team. And I I would proffer to say that that Jeter's turned the page. What would you say to something like that, I I would say he's definitely turned the page, um, and I don't expect him to be uh, at old-timers day – very often, but I think do if there was a day in the next twenty, thirty years, I think there is one that he will come back for at some point to be a part of, and, what, and what it'll would that, be a big deal. What would that day be? Twenty twenty seven. Twenty twenty seven. Yep. Okay. Am I, <laughs> am I missing something right there? What? 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 No, no I've just oh, made it up. You just, oh, you just made it up. No, I, I don't know. It just seems to me that it's. For 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 us Yankee fans, this is uh, this is wild to see that he's in charge of a team and Mattingly is his employee. I can't yeah. believe that. That's kind of crazy, right? It really is. I guess you live long enough, Aaron. You take care of yourself. Have a good game tonight, okay? All right, thank you, Rich. Take yeah, care. That's good, Aaron Boone, right here. I guess he was not interested in talking about Derek Jeter there at the very guess end. Not. I, I think Jeter, you. You will not see him running out, tipping his cap with the number two in pinstripes at an old-timers game like he's Whitey Ford from back in the day. I don't think you're going to see that anymore. I think he Jeter, in his mind, is like, I got the plaque. My number's out there. That's that part of my career. This is now this part of my career. And if I am going to make sure that this ship and what's best for the organization, this is my organization right now. It's interesting you even asked, would he even have pictures of his Yankee days yeah. on the wall? Probably not. He, he does strike me as that type of guy that this is my plan for the Miami Marlins. I'm focused on the Miami Marlins. That was the past. I honestly thought, like, okay, wh- whose day would he be back for? Because Rivera's already had his day. Torrey's had his day. Who's Tino, day would- Tino and Paul, have they had days yet? I don't think they're getting days. No. Costanza, maybe Costanza gets a day. I don't know. Posada, did he have a day yet? I don't know. I think they've all gotten the days. Oh, yes. Okay. Jeter was the last one to get yeah, his day. Right. Yeah. That's my plaque. Those are my numbers. You know, he'll talk about it when he gets his plaque in Cooperstown. But other than that, I, I don't know if this might be it. He's like I said, he's Just, coming in guns blazing. I think he's focused owner. on the new oh. career. The Rich Eisen Show, weekdays at noon Eastern on radio stations across the country and audience. If you like that video, be sure to download our app. Don't have any memory on your phone? Let's start to delete some of those slow-mo videos you have. And you know which ones I'm talking about.